Hey guys, what's up? Kyle here with Colossus Gaming, and today we are going to be looking at Star Wars Galaxies Emulator, or SWGEMU for short, I guess if you call that short. Now, first off, we're going to be looking at what Star Wars Galaxies is and was, and what an emulator is. Alright, so Star Wars Galaxies was a game originally released in 2003 by Sony Online Entertainment. It was an MMORPG, and it was an awesome game. Now, over the years with the success of other MMOs such as World of Warcraft, Star Wars Galaxies decided to overhaul their whole entire game. Now, when they did this, in the opinion of many players, they ruined the game, which is personally my opinion too. They added levels, they added all the stuff you see in a generic MMO, and they ruined what Star Wars Galaxies was. Now, that game lasted for a while and was decently popular until 2011, December 15th, when the game was finally shut down by Sony Online Entertainment. Now, that usually means the game's dead forever, but not with a game like Star Wars Galaxies. There were so many players that loved this game that they brought it back. That's right, that's what this emulator is. An emulator is pretty much the exact same game, but not the same game. Now, this emulator restores Star Wars Galaxies, or pre-CU Star Wars Galaxies, back to its original state in 2003, which was the awesome sandbox MMO, which I enjoy. Now, as many of you know, I am obsessed with sandbox features in games. That is my favorite kind of games. I've done videos about it. And that's why I love Star Wars Galaxies. Star Wars Galaxies has things such as player housing, player-owned factories, player-owned shops, player vehicles, different professions, no levels. You can make your own class pretty much because you're not limited to one profession. Some of these professions are really unique and awesome, like the entertainer. I mean... I have never ever played a game before where you can go in a bar and there's actual players dancing for your entertainment there. Now some players may call this game lacking of content, but that's just the kind of player that doesn't play a sandbox MMO. The whole point of a sandbox MMO is that players create their own content and do what they want, not what the producers want them to do. Now even though this game is from 2003, the graphics are still pretty good as you can see in the video. I've been playing this game for about the last... 10 days I would say. I never had the chance to play the original pre-CU game because I was about 9 years old back then, so I was not smart enough to play video games. However, I did play the Star Wars Galaxies after the overhaul, and now going back to pre-CU, I realized why it was so much better before Sony Online Entertainment overhauled it. I didn't even know this game still existed in any form until a couple weeks ago when I discovered it on the internet. When I was looking around at some new sandbox games. So if you loved Star Wars Galaxies before the overhaul, after the whole overhaul, if you've never even played the game, you should go check it out. There's a link in the description. It's a little bit difficult to figure out. All you need is an original copy of the game and the launch pad. It is 100% free. I would have to put this game pre-CU in my top three sandbox games of all time, up there with Darkfall and Worm. So I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you go check the game out. Thanks for watching. Remember, if you enjoyed it, subscribe, comment, rate me, let me know how I'm doing. Give me some feedback. If you want me to do a Let's Play of this game, I will if I get enough asks for the Let's Play. Because I don't want to do a Let's Play and have nobody watch it. So if this video gets decently popular, then sure, I'll do a Let's Play for it. It's a great game. See you guys next time.